Hi everyone. In this math Olympiad question, we're going to solve for positive integer solutions for a plus two ab plus b equals twenty two. So how 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 would we solve this? How are we going to solve two variable equations? Have we done this? Okay, let's try it. Here on left hand side, you have two variables that is a and b and you have the coefficient of a as 1 and coefficient of b as 1 and the coefficient of a b as 2 and on right hand side you have 22 so here on left hand side this 2 a b looks a bit ugly not suitable for the equation how should we solve this you have uh, a and b and the coefficient is 2 if you multiply the coefficients of a and b that is 1 times 1 even you get 1 1 times 1 is 1 not 2 so this looks a bit weird in the sentence so how do we solve this how to get rid of this 2 let's let's try to factorize it now when you're factorizing also you need to have some steps before factorizing what we can do is we can make the coefficients of a and b as 2 by multiplying both sides by 2 right all right let's multiply by 2 on both sides so you'll get 2a plus 2 times 2 is now you have 4ab plus you have 2b equals to 22 so this is how you have got the coefficients of ab as 2 when you multiply 2 times 2 you get 4 now it looks uh, a bit good because you have the same coefficients as you have it here now what can we do when you're factorizing something you should know that you're lacking a number in the equation when you're solving for this you have 2a you have 4ab you have 2b there's a number which you're lacking now, what's that number you're lacking and when you factorize it you get the answer in terms of factors factors are always written something like this always yes you have x plus a or x minus a or x plus b or x minus b now you you should know that the factors can be in terms of like you have the coefficient 2a let me write it down 2a plus or minus something 2b plus or minus something now that depends on the number which is lacking in the equation what's the number that's lacking in the equation will be now the coefficient of 2b here is 1 so i'm going to write plus 1 here the coefficient of 2a is 1 so i'm going to write 2b plus 1 now when you multiply that let, let me expand using foil method so you'll get the number which is lacking that's 2a times 2a you'll get 2a times 2b that's 4ab plus you have 2a times 1 that is 2a plus 2b times 1 that is 2b plus 1 times 1 that is 1 and that's equal to 22 on the right hand side now you have got the number which you were lacking that is plus 1 you have you have 4ab you have 4ab you have 2a you have 2a you have 2b you have 2b the number which you were lacking was plus 1 that's what is the number that you had to add on both sides plus 1 plus 1 so now when you add plus 1 you get sorry 22 times 2 was 44 not 22 44 then you are with the number which you're lacking was plus one so you get you add plus one here 44 plus one becomes 45 now let me write it down again 2a plus 1 2b plus 1 is equal to now 45 what about the factors of 45 that's 3 times 15 and 9 times 5 you can have two factors vice versa 3 times 15 15 times 3 5 times 9 9 times 5 so i think around four factors now what about the uh, factors here 2a plus 1 and 2b plus 1 now it says that it is positive integer solutions that means it is greater than or equal to 1 let us substitute 1 2 times 1 is 2 2 plus 1 is 3 so this term here is greater than or equal to 3 and what about this term if b is 1 2 times 1 is 2 plus 1 is 3 again it's greater than or equal to 3 so this term is also greater than or equal to 3 and this as well is greater than or equal to 3 let let me write it write it down again 2a plus 1 and 2b plus 1 now as you know the factors they are 3 15 9 and 15 let, let us write it down so this term equals to 3 
this term equals to 15 and vice versa you can have 15 and 3 and 9 and 15 sorry 9 and 5 9 times 5 is 45 9 times 5 and 5 times 9 so you have four factors here now you need to find what's a comma b so if you substitute 2a plus 1 equals to 3 2a is equal to 3 minus 1 that is 2 2 divided by 2 is 1 so your a is 1 comma b 2b plus 1 is 15 2b is equal to 15 minus 1 that's 14 14 divided by 2 that's 7 so you have got 1 comma 7 and for here you just interchange so let us write down 7 comma 1 and here 9 comma 5 let's substitute 2a plus 1 equals 9 so 2a equals 9 minus 1 that's 8 8 divided by 2 that's 4 so your a is 4 and what about this 2b plus 1 is 5 so 2b is 5 minus 1 that's 4 4 divided by 2 is 2 so that's your b2 vice versa change it 2 comma 4 so here you have four solutions for a and b that's how you find the solutions for a and b and that's your answer if you like this session don't forget to subscribe thank you so much for joining bye bye take care have fun